Hey guys, Josh with Carl's Mower and Saw, and here in my right hand is my favorite steel backpack blower. I know it's not their biggest and baddest one, but there's just something sweet about the BR600. I think it's the weight and power. 21 and a half pounds and 700 plus CFM and 200 plus miles per hour. This thing packs some punch and it's just a smooth operator. What sets this blower apart from other blowers in the industry, and honestly, as a whole, what sets the steel blowers apart is their four mix engine, is their smooth running, their anti-vibration, and their awesome big shoulder straps that make holding 20 plus pounds on your back for an hour comfortable. Let's take a look here at this anti-vibe system they have. There's one, two, three, four springs that isolate the engine from the operator so the vibration of this engine and this fan housing is not being translated to your back. Check out these shoulder pads here, these shoulder straps. We have two adjustments. We kind of have like, if I think of my backpack, I've got my main cinch that I pull to pull it in and then I've got my top that pull the top of the pack towards me, that pull the top of this blower towards me. See how thick they are? Nice foamy, padded, comfortable. They're wide and I have a nice lower back pad just to make this comfortable. Because when I strap on a backpack blower, I'm not just throwing this on for five minutes. I'm gonna have it on for a tank of gas. I'm gonna be moving a lot of leaves. A Couple other features. We have an adjustable uh, tube length, one, two, three. Me, for my height, I like this to be extended all the way out, but there are people that are a little shorter that wanna suck it up just a little bit. This Velcro strap is designed to retain or hold up the tube when it's in storage. So that's kind of nice in the shed, right? It's not flopping all over the place, just keep it clean. I can easily adjust where the handle, the throttle handle is, kind of uh, loosen that screw and slide this up and down. I have a cruise control, so if I get sick of holding the trigger with my hand, I can set the cruise control. Instead of holding this throttle lever like this, I can actually just kind of cradle or harness the blower tube. And I actually do that. You know, first I was kind of like, well, that's a cheesy feature. Why? Would... But when you're running this for a long time, it just gets, it gets cumbersome. It gets really, it's comfortable to be able to change. Flipping it around, this is Steel's renowned four mix engine, something that's been on the market now for 20 years that's proven to be a winner. It's mix fuel, right? So I'm running HP Ultra or Moto Mix with, if I'm running HP Ultra, I'm running it with ethanol free fuel, but it's a four cycle overhead valve engine. That means that it's easier to pull the rope on, it's easier to start, it's torquier, it's quieter, it's more fuel efficient, it's smoother. There's just so many benefits to this four mix engine when it comes to operation, longevity, durability. Check it out. Stop by Carl's Mower and Saw. Check out our full line of backpack blowers. Something a little bit smaller to something way bigger. Me personally, this is where I land, the Steel BR600.